All right, let's check out this trailer. Creature Commandos, the official trailer. They were really selling the show. They they really want us to like the show, man. And I'm intrigued. After what they said, I'm intrigued. So let's check this out. General Flag, you found yourself in the middle of an international incident. Viola Davis. Oh, princess. The United States is in the business of saving the damn world by any means necessary. What in the holy hell? Congress said we can't use human prisoners. These assholes aren't human. Do you understand me now? Who is she? We call her the bride. I was born here. <laughs> Who's Jason and the Argonauts? That's Dr. Phosphorus. Why are you doing this? It's business. This looks good, dude. I'm not gonna lie. What is that thing? The weasel. We know it has what it takes to survive. That's Nina Mazursky. Daddy? Huh? Last one is G.I. Robot. Cheers to the Tinder. I know you all aren't exactly enthusiastic about this mission. I didn't realize I had a choice. No, this show looks good. You said you this wanted me to good. be a hero. Not like that. With a joy that's hard to hide. Until we find yeah, it's our first look in the DCU, man. We're supposed to be on the same damn team. G.I. Friend Nina. You <laughs> Shish kebab. I'm just a soul. Don't be so hyperbolically violent. You need therapy. You wanted monsters. You got monsters. Hey. December 5th. He's not a Nazi GI. Oh, okay. Yo, okay, dude. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Is there anything else? No. All right, so I was really cool seeing the... Because these people, the actors, are going to be playing them in live action and in animation. So it's cool to see like the likeness of the actual actor in animation also. So, I mean, that's cool, dude. And the vibe of this, I really liked. I thought this was good. I'm definitely going to watch this show. I, I can, I'm, I'm going to like, I'm pretty sure I'm going to like this. All right. But we also got to remember, he, James Gunn said that each individual project, he's not going to have an overall aesthetic for the DCU, which I, I really like that. Each project, a Superman movie doesn't need to have the same aesthetic as a Batman movie. Okay. Just because you're in the same universe. I don't need, I don't need, and I don't need, Please, no Marvel jokes in every single movie. You know, like all Marvel movies are. Every single movie has the same formula, the same vibe. Okay? This, just off of this right here, I am I can guarantee you Superman is not going to have this vibe. Okay? So that's perfect. I love that. That's... I'm happy James Gunn understands that. That's good. Which means, it's from what I can, what I can take from that is, each character is going to stay true to themselves. Okay? It's not like, yo, we're in the DCU. This is the way the DCU is. Now, Batman in the DCU is going to be this way. Superman in the DCU is going to be this way. Okay? No, Batman's going to be Batman. Superman's going to be Superman. That's what I'm hoping. Now, the other question is, yeah, this is Creature Commandos. So the characters in Creature Commandos are going to be, they're going to be this way. But if we see these characters in Superman, are they going to behave differently? Or are they going to be like, like crazy like this? Okay? That's the other question. I hope they stay true to themselves no matter what project they're in. That's how you connect to the characters. That's how you build immersion. You know, you need that. You need to be con The characters need to be consistent with who they are. Getting the characters right is the most important thing. And in that regard, I'm so happy to see the vibe being unique. In that way, I like unique, okay? Because this should be unique from Superman. And it, it looks like that's what it's going to be. So let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. What do you guys think about the trailer? What do you guys think about Creature Commandos? Yo, no lie. James Gunn sold me. James Gunn sold me. Uh, I'm going to check out this show. 
-hmm. Now, what does this mean for the rest of the DCU? How do these characters play in with the rest of the characters in the DCU? Is it way too many characters? Is it, you know, how is that going to work out? Maybe I don't need to worry about it. Maybe it's like, this is Creature Commandos, that's Superman. They're two kind of, they're in the same universe, they're connected, but they're still two separate things. Like back in the day when we were watching Static Shock, I, I said this in another video. Back in the day, we were watching Static Shock. We're not wondering, yo, why is Superman not coming and helping him out? You're watching Static Shock. That's why. Okay? And when there's a cameo and when there's a crossover, it happens and it's awesome. All right? So maybe maybe you don't have to think too seriously. Don't don't think too deep about it. Just enjoy what you're watching. And when cameos happen, when crossovers happen, they happen. And that's cool. If that's the case, I'm totally fine with that. I can completely get behind that, man. I can completely get behind that. But let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. What do you guys think about Creature Commandos? And I'll see you all in the next video. Take care.